Hello everyone, Sean here once again. It is September 21st, 2022, and we're back with our daily Wordle. As always, please take a moment to like and subscribe, it really does help me out a lot. But for now, let's get into today's puzzle. Alright, we have an E in the second spot. I want to go with the word, uh, horde. Okay. That's not where that A goes. So looking at this structure here, um, let's see, I don't really think this is going to be the one. I actually think that A at the end is a lot more likely. And we've already rolled out having an extra, having an O in there somewhere. Uh, we might want to take a look at that second E. What are we looking at here? It can't be Tetra because the, that R doesn't go uh, in that fourth position, so... Actually, I want to look at the word feral. All right. So A does go in that fourth position. So do we have R E blank A blank? A few different options there. They've got. Um, any of the re words, so re tax, re cap. Um, what else? It's not in the middle, so what if I went at the end? Blank E, blank A R. I think it's going to go at the beginning. We're not seeing a lot there, so let's go with the word recap. All right, that's the word recap. Fantastic. Another four. Let's check out what Wordlebot has to say about that attempt. Decent skill, average luck. Perfectly fine by me. 71 with Aegis, down to 10 on Horde. Uh, oh, it did like our choice of horde. That's really interesting. Um, feral was not great. Only cut it down to half. But then recap just happened to get the right one. So horde and feral getting fairly low luck. And even though it was a wonderful choice, it was only 83% skill. Let's go with Horde. There's probably a few better words that there could have been. Let's see what Wordlebot did today. Oh, uh, I did just notice something here. So this would have been Wordlebot's pick if Wordlebot had done Aegis. Lycra would, be, would have been the next best one. I suppose that makes sense throwing in the throwing in the Y and also testing the A at the end, like we were tempted to do. And not not having it's interesting to throw the uh O back in after not getting an O here, still throwing in a Y to try and get the N, P, and L in there. Interesting. then would have picked recap. So I got lucky here. This is a one in five, and this is something I've been kind of looking at, is it does seem like when it when it comes down to less than 10, when it, it's, when the likelihood of each word structure 
is just com- comes down to a, a 50-50 or a one in five guess or everything's equally likely uh, near the end with those remaining structures. And there really isn't any um, skill required left. Wordlebot tends to get the word right away. So again, coming down, if there were five left, Wordlebot would have just got it 20% chance. I did too, but I don't. I often miss miss those when it comes down to one in three or one in two. So just something I've been eyeing up. It seems like Wordlebot does have a little bit of luck near the end there, or is maybe programmed to get that that last one. Now definitely doing its work to get these A, E, and R in the right spot here. And uh, with that P popping in there, definitely recap makes a lot of sense. So that makes sense. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. It does help me a lot. And share this video with anyone you think will enjoy some daily word puzzles. That's all for now, and we will see you all tomorrow.